what's going on you guys geeky here back with another video and today we are working on the 95 jeep wrangler doing two videos today and um i am going to be installing some mirrors because my jeep does not only has one mirror and i drove it the other day for the first time to work it was kind of crazy driving it with one mirror i have one mirror and one seat belt and the seat belt is on the passenger side because the driver's side the seat belt is ripped that is on the order so it is on the way but as of right now, we're going to fix the side uh, mirror issue. So I got these on Amazon for the pair. It was uh, 40 bucks, like $42. That's what they look like, you guys. They're like a matte black finish. I can put the link in the description. And they go bolted onto the doors. So let's go take a look at the doors check these out so this is how they come there is a left and a right I was thinking you could just turn the tabs so it is the pair for $42 I think they're on sale usually it's like $46 comes in this nice little protective bag so this is the right side right side goes right here So it goes like this, right here. Looks okay, doesn't look terrible. And it has full movement on this and this. So you can move it around if you like. It has this little cover right here. And then it comes with uh, new screws and a new little plastic plate so we can put that on there too. I might try to see if we can put the old ones back on. So it comes with this little plate. I don't know how this is supposed to work. But... Alright, so it comes with this little plate. Pretty much goes on the inside of the mirror itself. And the mirrors do have an R and an L on the inside of them. Alright, so I got one on you guys. Uh, this one didn't have a mirror at all, so I had to drill the holes. I'm pretty sure that usually the Jeeps come with pre-drilled holes for the original mirrors, but these ones did not have any. Uh, well, this door did not have any. The other side did. So all I had to use was a drill bit and then an M6 by .01 or 1.0 um, tap and die well tap and then um, to re to do these holes and I painted my screws black just because I didn't like the chrome um, but yeah and then pretty much you kind of got to just uh, eyeball it and then I used a punch to make the holes I just put it on here as it is right now Made a hole punch, hole punch, hole punch, and then started drilling to make sure I knew where I was at. And then um, this side is going to be the easy side because this one already has the pre-drilled holes. So all I'm going to do for this side is just remove it and then we're going to put the new mirror on and it'll look clean.
And on the other side, I did put some blue uh, Loctite just because it's a new um, thread and I don't know how good they're going to hold, but I'm sure they will hold. I just want to be extra cautious. So as you guys saw, that took me up all of two minutes to do on this side since it already had the holes. Yeah, I took it to work the other day and it was not cool. Not having both mirrors, it was kind of sketchy. So, oh look, there's the other Jeep in the back. And then this one. I like them like that, closer to the to the Jeep. Yeah, there we go. That looks good. Yeah. All right. Look, that's how that side looks. That's how this side looks. I think they look good, you guys. Uh, I like how I said it. I think they were on sale for forty-two dollars. I think they're usually like forty-six dollars, but I think they look good. They're a little wonky, but that's to be expected for forty-two dollars. And uh, I think now we are rocking and rolling. So this side it took me ten minutes just because I had to drill these holes. That side took me two minutes. So if you guys are just replacing them from your old worn down ones like this one it's like faded then it definitely is like a 10 minute installation if not it'd probably be like 25 minutes just to be safe because you've you got to make sure you're making the holes punching them on the right side and um, you know kind of fitment and all that stuff other than that I think it's all good you guys keep this one with this with the spare stuff here. We're gonna put the old cap back on that has nothing in it. So it sounds a little bit mintier. But yeah you guys there she is. She's all done. Thanks you thank you guys for tuning in to the channel um, and hope you guys liked all the Jeep content and you know just so you guys know stuff is sometimes worth getting cheap on amazon it is affordable it gets here fast and it's definitely uh easy installation so i appreciate you guys watching if you're new to the channel definitely subscribe and i appreciate the new subscribers and all the comments and likes thank you guys for watching peace y'all